with allergies, it's not that your immune system doesn't work. It's that your immune system is working too much. A hyper-functioning immune system. When you have somebody that has chronic infections, chronic sinus infections, chronic, chronic allergies, almost always when we find people that have some kind of a sinus or chronic uh, congestion problem that's going on, almost always we're going to find that they have some kind of chronic allergy issue. Almost always. There are exceptions to the rule, but still almost always. And the reason why is because in their nasal passageways, it's almost like they have a petri dish environment that's going on there all the time. And because of the extra mucus, because of the allergy issues going on, they are creating this mucus over a long period of time. They have chronic irritation, chronic inflammation that's going on in their nasal passageways, and that sets them up towards having chronic infections. So dealing with the overactivated immune system problem that's going on there could be that your omega-3s are not where they need to be. Could be that hormones are off. Could be that some other B vitamin that's off. Could be that there's actually, it could be mold in the environment. Could be that they actually, that you, you cannot necessarily control everything that you breathe. Sometimes it's because of something they're eating. Remember those three allergies I talked about earlier? The IgEs, Gs, and As? Well, you can't always control this one right here, especially at the outside stuff with dust and ragweeds. Uh, but you can control these, the things that you, you eat, you consume. And sometimes when you control these, you can have an impact on these. So lots of things that you can do at home um, and also things that we can test here and look at to see why is there an overactivated immune system? What can we do to bring down the immune system to help the body to just support it so it can do its, the job it's designed to do, which is to heal and repair and self-regulate?